So the Honda Bream winning battle is already live on a, in a boat for boat sense, not just a points basis. Honda Marine holding a line pretty easily though. Thematically, but at the moment winning group on port, marginal, oh they didn't think they could cross. That's it, they didn't think they could cross Honda Marine. Look at that, they've taken the advantage downwind mark and that's where they made most of their gain. Bit of boat speed across here. We thought winning route were clear across on port. Clearly it was too close to call for winning group. Couldn't afford a, a risky protest, so they do the right thing. They attack, they're heading to Lourdes, and now it's a proper test between the two best boats in the fleet. How close are they, Bucko? Just a couple of centimeters. As you see, then Honda just plant one right on the face of winning group. For once in my life, disagree with you, Bucko. I normally agree with you. Honda Honda's, Green have got a lot on here. Honda's Plenty on. Slow they're, have, they're stopping. And winning group in the meantime, sail around the back, taking advantage. This is far from a non-issue. This is not the ferry sailing straight through at all. This is a massive issue. This changes the whole race right here. Winning group have definitely crossed that ferry. And note, at Honda Marine, will Honda Marine get across or not? This is looking marginal at best. But, Mark, I mean, take the point. Honda's judge, judgment all week has been sensational. Yeah, we're provisional and premature, but we've given the Giltman yeah. to the Kiwis. Don't make any financial decisions based on what we're about to tell you. It is provisional, but we're pretty confident that uh, uh, Honda Marine are the winners of the 2020 JJ for the third time in a row. There is your race, race nine. Last race, beautiful sunny conditions, 10 knots, not too many ferries, top yacht racing from Sydney Harbour. I think they're gonna be they're slowing down, doing the slow down duck maneuver, I think. Look at that, nicely executed by Honda Marine. Didn't want to tack back, didn't want to do a fast duck. So that's the other option you've got, of course, in a high speed boat like this, slow down. If you can keep your boat control, you slow down and just do a little bit. Nicely what a masterclass move though, like just how easy they perform these manoeuvres, you know, it's awesome to watch. I'm standing here with the winners of the third JJ Gilderman in a row, Team Honda Marine, from all the way from New Zealand. How's it feel? Yeah, pretty good at um. Yeah, it feels better and better every year. Getting used to it. And boys, uh, three in a row, do you think that gives you the rights now to bring this thing back to New Zealand? I know back at the Royal Akarana Yacht Club, uh, Howie Spencer, Anatole Massman, and a few other people have really tidied up that place. We had the 49er Worlds there a little while back. It's a great venue. Would you like to see it back home in your home waters? Oh, absolutely. I think we've done, you know, we've put our best foot forward that we could possibly do. Um, We've got another regatta in New Zealand that we want to coming up next year in um, 2021 called the America's Cup, which we want to line the two regattas together. I don't know if I've heard of that. Yeah, it's just this other sailing event. Not, um, not as important as the JJ Gilden Trophy. Mate, JJ is so important we have to race no matter what's going on. Last regatta in the world is still happening. There we go, you never know, there might not ever be another sailing event. Brad, big week on the bow. You guys have sailed amazingly well, mate. How does it feel? Uh, it's Awesome, yeah, amazing. So, so good. Gutted my mum and dad can't be here, but obviously with the, the virus and stuff that's going on, it's best to go home. And so, thanks, thanks to them, and yeah, we'll be, be home soon. After two weeks quarantine, I might see you. Two weeks of fishing coming up, Maddie. We're gonna go out fishing on the cruising boat. Not at home, so. Yeah. Well, we'll, uh, we'll get Steve quickly here from the yacht club. He's gonna hand you guys the traditional blue ribbon. It's interesting. Uh, Interesting uh, concept we've got this year. <laughs> Here we go, bit of spreading of it. We did nine races. We've had some top skiff action. Um, it's a little bit odd not having the spectator ferry out at the end. This is when traditionally the boat tries to get alongside the spectator ferry. It's a little bit of drama and they get the blue ribbon and it's against the backdrop of hundreds and hundreds of people cheering wildly on the spectator ferry. But for obvious reasons, we can't do that. But that doesn't take anything away from the victory of Honda Marine. And it'll still feel pretty special for them. Their third win in a row. 